anniversary of Good Morning La La Land, we, uh, I got the opportunity to interview all of these wonderful hosts, and we have the creator here, producer uh, Andy Wallman. Uh, thank you very much, guys. I am so proud to be here. Uh, first, I want to uh, present everybody uh, with a little uh, token of my appreciation and uh, for celebrating our one-year anniversary. This Yay. is so fun. We couldn't do this without you, Andy. We're so grateful. What? It, oh, wow. wow. That's Look beautiful. That. Look at oh, that. It's so, beautiful. so pretty. That's Andy, wonderful. we just want to that's say amazing. thank you so much Can you guys for see? being yes. the angel for everyone and bringing this community together of over 800 guests and showing up every day, having the space and really doing an incredible job. Thank you so much, Andy, for everything. And you are like the Gelman. You're in the back and you're, you're cut to here and go here and go there and go there. Yeah. And you literally make it all happen every day. And it's just an amazing gift that you have. And, and you have these wonderful hosts, obviously. But tell us just a tiny little bit about you because you're behind the scenes every day. I just wanted to say uh, how we sort of started the show. I know Aaron explained a little bit uh, early on. And first of all, uh, it's been really a pleasure. 245 shows, one hour shows, all live. Uh, no editing. They're all available online. GoodMorningLawLand.com, FocusTVNetwork.com slash GoodMorningLawLand. <laughs> 810 guests, which you just saw in the preview before. Um, and the way it sort of happened was is that Aaron was a guest, like uh, she said earlier, on Tanya Memi. Shout out to Tanya Memi. Uh, uh, she's one of our flagship hosts at Focus TV. And uh, she did a great interview. And then she decided to uh, host her own show, The Dr. Aaron Show which you can watch uh, on Focus TV. <laughs> um, and one of her first guests was Rob Mack, but uh, more on that later. Uh, and then Erin said she had the great idea to, uh, she wanted to host a morning show uh, by herself uh, every day. I said, okay, that's, uh, that's probably uh, a little over the skis for me. Uh, but I said, if you can get a couple of co-hosts, let's do it. Um, and uh, the search began. And then, as Jesslyn said earlier, she uh, went to a pool party and she was a guest on the Harry Howard, uh, Harry and Kelly show on Focus TV. And uh, after that interview, she stuck around, said uh, she might want to do some other things at the network. OK. Um, and then uh, a few days went by and uh, I told Aaron that uh, we might have a potential co-host, a second co-host for you. But Erin did say one thing, that she did not want to have another blonde girl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she did. See, when you don't want something, it happens. So uh, she was looking for that magical person. Uh, but after meeting Jaslyn, she said, uh, OK. And then there was one other slight detail that uh, Jaslyn put out there. And she did mention it, that uh, she did make it clear that anything she did at the network uh, would have to be in the afternoon because she's not a morning person. <laughs> I repeat, she's not a morning person. Uh, this is a morning show. Uh, and she said, okay. She still said, okay. Mm. After the, on those drinks at Craig's. <laughs> uh, shout out to Craig. Um, and, then, uh, and then we need a third person. And Erin went to Rob Mack. Yeah. Wow. Whoa. Rob Mack, the sleeper. <laughs> one of her first guests on the Dr. Erin show. And uh, co-host on Famously Signal with Laurel House, another Focus family member. Shout out to Laurel House. Um, and then uh, we assembled. We said, okay, let's try for 90 days and uh, let's see how it happens. And the one thing Aaron said, and this is the one thing that made this show happen, was momentum. It had to be every day. It had to be every day. And sure, you could get by a couple of weeks, two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, three guests, two guests, five guests, one guest. And wow. Then 90 days passed and Let's do. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Aaron uh, was leading the bus, leading the momentum charge. It was momentum every day, every day, every day, and then more every days. Mm. <laughs> Can't express that enough. Two hundred every day, and we go live at nine a.m. Pacific time, uh, and that means you've got to get here through traffic uh, with our the amazing guest, eight hundred and ten guests in one year's time. Uh, that doesn't even include the events that these guys cover, uh, red carpet events, daytime Emmy Awards, uh, Grammy Awards, mm. uh, viewing party. Um, it is just an amazing body of work that these guys have done. Uh, and it is all captured online and to be watched back again. And that really is the key to what we do here is we tell the stories of people uh, in our local community uh, to be viewed uh, anytime, uh, 
anywhere uh, online on Focus TV on Good Morning La La Land. Um, and I just want to also acknowledge, Jess and Rob, you guys are like your work ethic, who you are. I know we've gone through like little tiny like glitches, like kind of things, but like I love you guys so much, mm. and you guys are just like family. Yeah. And I'm proud of all of us for like. Mm. You know, I had moments where I was like trying to control things, like it needs to go this way. And I was like, okay, I guess I'll surrender again. You know? like, I think it's better. And then, you know, whatever. And so I just want to just, you guys are amazing. Your work ethic, who you guys are, what, how you show up is like, it's the real deal. It's wonderful. Oh, thank you so much. Thank yeah. you. So much. Yeah. It is the real deal. And uh, the show has so many people. I mean, you've heard this before. You've heard show interviews before and everything else. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But. It's for real. Uh, other than the host, I definitely want to thank Corey for yep. this great idea thank to uh, yeah. celebrate our one-year anniversary. Wow, that was a good idea uh, when she came up with it. And, you know, I, I know as soon as she mentioned it, I said, that's what we're going to do. I also want to say thank you to uh, other people that have made this show helpful. Uh, Victoria Simone, she mm -hmm. was a great producer for us. Uh, Gina Moreno and uh, Emma Merriman, who's now uh, our current producer. Uh, uh, Tara, yes, amazing. Miranda, Miranda yes. Mm. Uh, Leticia on makeup. Uh, just some amazing uh, participation from amazing people. And that's the most special is the PR people. And they have done an amazing job supporting our community here. We could not have done it without them. We have some invited here. We're going to see them after this segment. And I just have to say thank you, thank mm. you, thank you thank for you. all your help and support. You guys have been amazing respectful and uh it's that energy that has kept this show going for 245 mm. shows 810 guests <laughs> one wow. year live at 9 a.m every weekday good morning la la land dot com <laughs> so actually, I'm sure viewers would like to know, like, what are some of the behind the scenes stories that have gone on? It's been really interesting because you think about behind the scenes, but really the whole thing has been a total scene. I mean, from the literally from the set to the red carpet, we were at the daytime, the daytime Emmys, you guys. I mean, this was unreal. We were invited to be a part of the style lounge and get all glammed up and every single red carpet. And I mean, it's just been incredible to be embraced the way we mm. have. Rock to recovery. Rock to recovery, yes. West Gear. I mean, oh, it's been a busy year. Well, incredible. I also want to interject there because I also want to give an extra shout out to Jeslyn, who oh. uh, during the year <laughs> has become the managing editor editor of Focus Magazine. Mm. Yes, right here. I'm so excited. She has done an amazing job with that. Uh, this is Huska Musk on our current issue, and she's also an executive at the Focus TV network uh, in charge of so many things. I can't tell you. Uh, <laughs> and doing beauty, uh, beauty events Yeah, now, focus so. on beauty events, mm -hmm. uh, helping build this community however I can. Which, going right. back to your story, you were, you were not feeling good. You were sick, and look at how all of the things that have transpired from that. You've just really made a lot happen. That's well, beautiful. I couldn't have done it without all of you. Yeah. Yeah. So thank you. And yeah, I want to share you. the most heartfelt appreciation for you, Andy, truly. Mm. You are like the hashtag, the community, and the power part all in one. I mean, as hard as particularly these um, two ladies work, you are the absolute hardest working for sure. man. Person. Yes, let me uh, <laughs> let me give it. Let me give a shout out to my wife Felicia, <laughs> oh, who has been incredibly you. supportive for uh, this period of uh, multiple years uh, in the Focus TV network and the Good Morning La La Land. It does require a few extra minutes of uh, <laughs> minutes? of of, <laughs> of activity. She's been incredibly supportive. Uh, she's been to the show. She was on episode one, mm. and she's now on episode two hundred and forty six. <laughs> Uh, and it's so much appreciated. And mm -hmm. we also have uh, somebody who was also on uh, the first episode Sorry. of the show. Look at your little love. Look oh, at this mask. So can I ask some of you guys, like, who would be somebody you would want to come on the show? Oprah. Okay, <laughs> Oprah. You know what? Honestly, Oprah, if you ever get to see this, I so appreciate all of the hard work and all the soul that she put for into sure. building her network and that is what we're trying to do here with the focus magazine with focus tv network with good morning la, la land is to inspire to empower to entertain and to ignite a conversation that changes each and every one of the people involved in the show and each and one of our viewers so she has been an incredible icon um and oh. force and pioneer in in the industry so that would be we'd love to have you oprah <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Ditto. Have some goals. And I will jump in here. If anybody does want their story to be told, uh, there are no better three people to tell mm. that story than these people on the couch. Uh, they are doing incredible work. These are not three-minute interviews that you see on the TV. These are 15, 20-minute in-depth interviews live, unscripted, uh, and in the early morning in many cases. Uh, and they just do an amazing job. Uh, and you've got to watch back some of these interviews. Uh, if we had maybe three or four hours, we could go through my favorite ones. <laughs> um, but... Each and every person that has come through these doors, 810 strong, have been incredibly, incredibly positive, uh, giving of their time. And I feel that we've all had an amazing mutual experience uh, telling these people's stories. And we hope to continue telling more stories to come. Mm. Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much for today. I really appreciate it. And I'm so grateful and honored to be a part of this birthday it's your birthday it's a one-year anniversary so i appreciate you allowing me into your hearts and on this couch which is a new couch from the last time because <laughs> i sunk down the last time so <laughs> hey, thank you i guess you wear out a couch pretty fast yeah well yes. it's so nice uh, to be yes. able to break this one in with you guys so but thank you over on the other side are we gonna yes we are gonna now take it we're gonna go to commercial and then after commercial we are gonna thank the powerhouses mm. that have helped this show succeed over 245 episodes 810 guests when we come back stay tuned